Hello. So, since you are so hard to reach nowadays because of the whole switch in your uh, work schedule, I'm just going to make videos and Tawana will show them to you and it'll be okay. I assume. So, <laughs> um, I have a few updates because the other day I did call you didn't answer. Well, yesterday I called and you didn't answer because you're at work. But I did talk to Tawana for a really long time. It was really hot. It's been really hot um, the past, I guess, three days. It hasn't, it hasn't, before, I think for the first, like, two weeks of summer, it was um, okay weather. And then there was a tsunami. And then, oh no, no, not a tsunami, a typhoon. There was a typhoon, so there was a lot of rain and clouds, but it, was, it wasn't it was super hot because of the rain. Um, but yeah, especially yesterday and Saturday, it was really, really, really hot. And as I was talking to Tawana, I um, was just outside. I thought that I was going to like take a walk and talk to her at the same time because I have been working out and trying to eat healthier and so I wanted to like walk around as I talked to Tawana on the phone but then it didn't work that way because it was just way 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 too hot so I just sat at a convenience store and took in all of the air conditioner. <laughs> Um, and sat outside as well just for a change of scenery here and there and to not feel like I was being a bother to them. Um, but yeah, that's all I really did. Today was also kind of hot, but I'm, I've been in my house all day. Um, when I went out earlier, it wasn't that hot, but I think it got hotter throughout the day. So yeah, um, tomorrow I start um, working or helping out at the elementary school um, for their English camp. I actually don't know what they're what they're learning. Um, I'm kind of just there to observe and help the other um, native English teacher out a little bit. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm doing that because my school has construction going on this summer and I don't know if you remember, but they also had construction going on in the winter, um, but this is a different one. Before it was the windows, this time it's the floor, so um, we don't have, we're not having an English camp, which is why I'm, I'm going to the elementary school instead. So yeah. Um, what else? Oh, this weekend. I'm so, so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Because I'm dancing with you can see. <laughs> because um, I'm going to Busan for the first time. So, because you don't know anything about the geography of South Korea, I will put a map right here in this region, hopefully, if I get to editing. Okay? Um, and I normally... So I live in Jongsan, which is um, kind of like, um, it's south <laughs> compared to Seoul, which is one of the major cities. Busan is also another major city, but it's on the opposite coast in south um, in comparison. And I live between the two, um, like in that diagonal line between the two, kind of. So I... And I'm not <laughs> as close to the ocean as Busan, um, but I am going to Busan for the first time ever. I'm usually in Seoul whenever I go anywhere because that's where my friend lives and most of the other people that I know live in that area. Um, oh, my arm hurts, so I keep switching hands. Um, so... Yeah, I'm going to Busan for the first time ever, and I'm going with a friend um, because we have to. We're gonna drive there um, because a train ticket to Busan is like 
the minimum, I think, 40-something dollars. Um, and it takes about, and that one would take like four and a half, four hours, four and a half hours. A bus ticket is around $35 and that would take five hours. So we kind of just decided that we would get a car and, um, and drive the five hours there. That way we don't have to spend money on taxis or, tra or other transportation or more in Busan, but the reason we're going is because of water bomb, um, and I'm excited because it's basically just like a music festival, but there's water, so, <laughs> so I won't be sweating as, I'll still be sweating as much, but I'll get the breeze of being around water. Um, everyone gets like water guns, and it's kind of like a water gun fight, um, in a concert, and there's a pool area too, so I think it'll be really fun. Um, I'm really excited, mostly to eat some seafood because that's kind of what um, all the coastal areas on the east coast of, um, of Korea are kind of known for, especially Busan, it's their seafood. So super excited to have some good food and to listen to some music and not so much to be around a lot of people, but Yay music, yay water, yay food. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Um, okay, so, like I said before, probably just going to start doing uh, short videos and say hi every now and then. Um, so, if you have any questions for me, I would say either message me or tell Talana to message me. That way I can just answer them in a video. And... Okay. Also, oh, I got my hair done this weekend. So, again, I got my hair done again this weekend. Um, so, you know that it was in, I had the bob, the little, like, I had a bob of box braids in. Um, and then I went to a water park, and right before going to the water park, I took them out just so that I'd have some time in between um, protective hairstyles for my hair to just be out and free. Um, so it's been like that for, I think it was like that for about three weeks where I didn't have a style, but I went this weekend and got my hair into these two, these two, um, cornrows and you know, this side is still cut. Um, it is long enough now that when I go back to get my hair braided back into the singles, um, I will probably, then, then I'll be able to braid this in as well, but for now, I am just doing the two, the two strands because I kind of, I kind of missed having long hair, but, um, last time I did singles that were long, they were kind of bothersome, and, yeah, I kind of just wanted a break from the, the, uh, bob, especially because it's hot, oh my god. If I had a bob right now, I'd be so, so sweaty. But yeah, so I just kind of took a break from that, got my hair out of my face and up in this. Um, while I was at the hair salon, I bought some of this. Um, it's basically gel, right? It says perfect edges, but um, the lady used it to slick down this side when she did it. And no, I do not have any pictures because the moment I stepped outside, it sweat out. So, <laughs> so I'm probably not actually going to use that um, anytime soon. But I do have it just in case I like want to, you know, work on my edges a little bit because I have been needing um, gel for my edges. I keep, I keep messing with them, but never really getting them slicked down so yeah um i think that's all i really needed to say or wanted to say so i'll see you next time bye